Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're unboxing the Animal Crossing New Horizons Collector's Box, so we'll get straight into it. We'll get the plastic off, guys, and we'll show you the uh, colourful box. So do let us know in the comments what you think, guys. And if you haven't already, do subscribe to the channel. So um, this is the um, second edition. There was a, a uh, earlier edition, guys. Make sure you check that one out on the channel if you want to uh, see the uh, differences and similarities. Uh, so that one was pretty cool, in my opinion. But uh, we'll check out the uh, different contents that we're going to have on the inside of this one. So we'll pull everything out, and then we'll check everything one by one. Okay. Nice little figure there, that's pretty cool. The other one had like socks and a blanket and stuff like that. So like I said, guys, uh, feel free to check that one out on the channel. So first up, looks like we've got some sort of, um, I don't think it's a uh, snow globe, looks like it. It's just a LED desk light, okay? So that's what it is. Again, very nicely detailed box. Lots of um, Animal Crossing goodness all the way around. Pretty typical of their, um, the Animal Crossing range of stuff. It's always very colorful. It's very tight. Just be careful, guys. It's the uh, very flaky foam as well, so be careful. Probably gonna make a bit of mess if you're not. Um, so we need some, uh, there's our base. Okay. On uh, this side here, we plug in a uh, power adapter or you can, uh, insert some batteries in the uh, in the bottom compartment okay just trying to um, lift it open it's proving a little bit difficult okay some help so we've got some batteries in the bottom of this so three double-a batteries guys and that will uh, power up your uh, LED light without plugging it in. They didn't give us a cable, um, so you've got to source your own cable and you'll be able to plug it in. We'll get our um, standee in. So it clicks in like so, and it says there's a power button on the front there. It doesn't push in or anything, but maybe it's uh, touch activated, okay? Otherwise it just stays on or off, but we'll check that out. What I'll do, I'll put, get some batteries and we'll uh, check it out in the outro, guys, so stick around for that. Okay, looks like we've got a uh, little canvas print here. Again, with some plastic on it, so we'll uh, just get rid of the plastic and we'll be able to take a better look. Okay, so again, very nicely detailed and colorful. You got all the uh, Animal Crossing characters in the uh, on the front there. On the back, not too much going on. You do have a, uh, a hook here to uh, hang it up on your wall for uh, display purposes. It probably will stand up like that, so you can choose to um, just have it on your desk, like so, or um, hang it up on the wall. We have the next part, it seems to be a, uh, it says a journal, it's probably just a sort of like a notepad. So the front and rear of that. Tom Nook's uh, ink, it's got a little strap there to hold it all together, and it is just a notebook, guys. Nothing else on the pages, just blank pages with the uh, lines to um, start um, taking down some notes. We've got the uh, little paper there that you probably don't need once you open it. We've got a set of pins here as well. So you've got KK and uh, Nook there. So you can um, display them where you like to display them. And then we've got um, some, uh, some plates here, which is pretty cool. Probably give these to my daughter so she can uh, eat off but um, you got there you got the uh, DAL the um, flight service you got even the uh, Animal Crossing and uh, Nintendo logos and all that sort of stuff on the bottom these are a plastic plate guys so like I said I'll give them to my daughter she, um, she won't break them when they uh, drop off the uh, table and again we've got uh, Tom Nook and uh, the uh, Animal Crossing character there looks like they're um, making something from some of the uh, the timbers and rocks that you collect from the game and final part is the Isabel statue. Now, no tape, no tape on this. Okay. There's our little figurine. So again, on the bottom, you've got all the information about the characters. And then there is your uh, Isabel character that you can uh, have displayed on your desk or uh, in your uh, games room, okay? So that's everything included, guys. Quite a bit um, included in this, um, so that's quite impressed. Uh, I'm not too sure which one's my 
favourite, probably. Um, look, they both got um, good points and bad points, uh, the uh, first edition and the second edition, but um, overall, um, I am liking this one a little bit better. You've got the light, uh, you've got the little wall display, you've got a couple of plates as well, and the notepad that uh, is going to come in handy. So uh, there you go, guys. That's everything included in today's box. Like I said earlier, do let us know in the comments what you think, and if you haven't already, do subscribe to the channel. But for now, we're going to conclude this part of the video. Welcome back guys, so I got some batteries into uh, the light and as you can see, uh, we've set it all up already. Just add the uh, three batteries in the bottom and then it is just a touch uh, pad guys. So you just tap it and it turns on, nice blue color. It does illuminate uh, quite a lot and also projects um, sort of blue onto the uh, ceiling if it's close by as well. And then to turn it off, you just tap it again. Okay, so on and off. I assume it works the same way once it's powered into mains power. You just don't need any of the batteries. But to keep it portable, guys, just put the uh, three uh, AA batteries in it and uh, you're good to go. So um, if you did enjoy this video, guys, don't forget to subscribe to the channel before you leave. Hit the like button. If you didn't, hit the dislike. Once we get to the next milestone, we're in the next giveaway. So do subscribe if you're running for that. And we'll catch you next time.